Hello YouTube and welcome to this video. Today I'll be showing you an application called Always On Top Maker. Always On Top Maker has many uses but I'll just show you one really quickly. So let's say you want to copy some text into another application such as Notepad. So I'm going to copy the text then I have to go to the bottom of my taskbar, click on the Notepad application and paste the text in here. What Always On Top Maker can do is make Notepad always on top of Firefox. For example, Firefox is the foreground application, Notepad isn't, and I can still keep Notepad on top while trying to find the text. So, you want to go to this website and the link will be in the sidebar. Scroll down and go to download. As you can see, it's only 6K, which is tiny. So I'm going to click, I'm going to open it with WinRAR, and then I'm just going to paste the application or extract the application to my desktop. Then close WinRAR. Now I can double click on the application and that will run Always On Top Maker. Sadly, it does not give an icon in your system tray, but you can check if it's open by right clicking on your, ta on your taskbar, then go to Task Manager, then go to Processes, uh, then go to Image Name and look for Always On Top Maker.exe. You can also kill this process by going to end process and then click OK. So, how do you use this always on top maker? I'm just gonna open up Notepad to be the foreground application. You can check if an app if an application is the foreground application by seeing if it has a darker title bar, as you can see, it has a darker title bar than Firefox for example. And also if you're in Vista or seven you should see a shadow behind that window unless you've disabled that effect so let's enable the always on top maker so I'm gonna hit control alt T which is the hotkey for always on top maker so control alt T your system should make an error sound which is normal and then now I can just make Firefox the foreground application as you can see it has a darker title bar and notepad has a lighter one and I can scroll on Firefox and for Firefox is the foreground application however notepad is still on top so that's how always on top maker works if you would like always on top maker to start when you start up Windows you can simply get the application right click go to cut go to your start button go to all programs right click on startup and then go to open then paste it in here if you would like an application that you've enabled the always on top maker on, for example notepad, to disable the always on top maker on that particular application, you want to hit control alt T, your system will, won't make an error sound this time, um, but your an application, the application that you use the always on top maker on, will simply go behind any other window. And let's make Firefox the foreground application now, and open notepad, and let's click on Firefox, you should see that notepad goes behind as normal and um, I guess that's pretty much it so thanks for watching please comment rate and subscribe and thanks again